I hope something big. Uh... We're gonna bring a show as a team. Past, grandiose, chaos. And it's once in a lifetime. Tour is a tour, eh? There are many ways to prepare the tour. Ouais, je pense que toutes les étapes qui arrivent au sprint peuvent euh, me convenir. This is Orbea Road. Welcome to the Tour de France. Twenty-one days to the start of the Tour de France. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's the most important now? Of course, today I hope that we can uh, make, of course, a top result today uh, by not winning. But for me, it's, it's, it's even more important the upcoming month, let's say, uh, with the nationals uh, everywhere, with the uh, with the tour, of course. Uh, I don't want to put too much pressure on. Not here, and also not in the Tour of Switzerland. Of uh -huh. course. If we can take something, we do it. Eh? That's, that's 100% sure. So you but would say it's more important now to gain confidence? Yeah, and yeah, 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 yeah. Max. Do you know how many days are until Tour of France, the beginning? 30, 25? 21. 21. It'll be nice to uh, start Tour de France like this. Yeah, the Tour is always looking at the Giro de Rebe. It's hard to take it. But this year is an opening weekend that has to be there. It begins not with a massive sprint or with a time rate. Not with an actual berg, but more with a point. Het is wel een etappe aan met liggen, dus uh, ik kijk vooral uit naar het uh, eerste weekend en de eerste twee etappes. Ja, sowieso. Als je het parcours uh, bekijkt, er is, uh, er is een kans. Hè. En, uh, het zijn natuurlijk uh, 50 renners in het peloton die dat denken. Maar dat is, dat, het is ook de tour, hè. het gaat niet gemakkelijk zijn. This is my 16th Tour de France in 19 seasons. Tag! There's only one rule. You have to don't you have to drive fast, you have to drive smooth. That's the only rule there is. There are many ways to prepare the tour. And you see every year a part of the Peloton chooses for Dauphiné, part of the Peloton chooses for Swiss. Ja, het is moeilijk om dat in procenten uit te drukken, maar je kunt dit nog gebruiken om die laatste percentjes beter te worden. Dan zijn we nu al te laat als je nog spectaculair moet verbeteren. Dus het moet al redelijk top zijn. I think Swiss is also a little bit less media attention. I have the feeling for Arnaud. It's, it's good to be a little bit like um, out of the spotlight towards the Tour. There's already a lot of pressure on him s without doing nothing. So it's good he can here be in Swiss. Hola, ¿qué tal, hombre? Muy bien, sí, Swiss, beautiful, uh, white. <laughs> What's English with a Spanish accent? It was That's good, it. no? Easy. Euh, ce sera mon premier Tour de France, euh, j'arrive avec un sentiment... Euh... Ouais, j'ai vraiment envie de découvrir euh, ce, ce nouveau monde, entre guillemets, parce que voilà, le Tour de France est assez spécial. Ah, né. non, euh, ouais, tous les objectifs que je m'étais fixés ne sont pas atteints, euh, entre autres avec la maladie de Lyme. Lyme. Mais euh, voilà, maintenant c'est derrière moi, c'est de l'expérience en plus dans mon, mon bagage. Our responsibility is that they're in shape. It, it's a bumpy road towards the tour. So then it's our responsibility to also judge if they're ready. 
like uh, if we see on training that the values are not there, then it's our responsibility to say to the sports director, he's not ready. In the tour, there's a, you have sprint stages, you have time trials, you have mountain stages. So for each rider, we're going to bring four race bikes, two TT bikes, like 80 sets of wheels, a lot of spare stuff. The week before, we have a lot of work, we make sure everything is perfect, like tip-top shape. And then during the, the stages, we just maintain. On the rest day, we give an, an extra uh, maintenance. So yeah, you need to stay focused for the whole four, yeah, for us it's four weeks. You need to stay focused for four weeks, that, that's pretty hard. Uh, the Orbea bikes for us is the first year we use them. Uh, the riders are super happy. We as mechanics are super happy. Uh, we, yeah, it's easy to work on because they, yeah, they are very high-end bikes. Uh, so, yeah, super bikes. Yeah, I'm really excited for my first tour. Everyone talks about it and it's like a big circus on wheels, but yeah, to actually be going there, it's a childhood dream, really. Are we rolling? Are we rolling? Yeah, yeah? Let's go. Um, Het is mijn eerste tour, dus ja, een beetje, een beetje ongeloof, een beetje een droom dat, dat uitkomt. Dus er is wel een beetje zenuwen dat erbij komen. Maar ik probeer die niet bovenhand te laten nemen en gewoon te vertrouwen op de, de voorbereiding die ik al heb gedaan nu. Like everyone asks you, like if you're a cyclist, oh you do the Tour de France. No, like but that's what I want to do and then so to now be able to say like, yeah, that's, I've done the Tour de France is, is massive. That it's very clear what the task is going to be in the last three weeks. Day by day helping our leaders, uh, Arno in the sprint obviously, Maxim in the climbing stages, protect those guys, keep them out of the wind for as long as possible and then yeah, mainly in the sprint help uh, him and Cedric in the lead out. The biggest challenge, hmm, I think we can divide it into two categories. So at first, we need to make sure that the riders get in shape on the right time, um, not too early, not too late, just in like a healthy way. But then on the other side, we need to keep them healthy. So we also need to prevent that they get sick. Uh, they still need to race before the tour, so to get in the race rhythm. Max, all is super good regulated. Uh, you have a double of personnel to over another race. The riders are very lucky that the staff is really dedicated to them. So we make sure that everything is on the right time, on the right moment for them. I was already, I had it already. It's like a pin day. Ik denk ja, voor renner, als renner heb je het gevoel dat alles relaxter en makkelijker gaat, omdat alles zo gestructureerd en goed is georganiseerd. They are just working hard and it's the least what we can do for them is just to provide everything in an easy way and on the right time, on the right moon, because like getting it wrong one day can make you lose or win a stage in the tour or, or can make your whole career. So. So this is our truck for the Tour de France, we're preparing it now, let's have a look. So this is the truck, the kitchen of the truck for the Soigneurs, you see there's a lot of place. So here, as you can see, it's a very big closet full of bottles, so in here we just put 1100 bottles. But also we have here our uh, products for the bottles, and then we have uh, coming like a bit more bandages. Because it's a tour, it's super stressful, very hectic, so crashes will happen. One place full of caps, only for the fans. Because we love our fans, and they love us. As a fan, I'm excited about going to the Tour de France, where everything is turned up to 11. Any more questions? I hope something big uh, with the tour is, uh, is something really big. Uh, the highest level of the year. Everybody is like 10% better as the rest of the season. So 
I hope Max is also uh, 10 or maybe 15 percent better all the rest of the season. And I hope in one of the stages uh, everything uh, falls together and I can have uh, a really, really nice and big moment, like a big boom, and it will uh, make my career, I think. I expect a lot from Maxim. Yeah? Yeah. Arno also. It is, these are our two best cards to play, that's for sure. So we have the courts and now we have to hope that, that one day the courts fall all good for our team and then, then we are capable, we have the guys to win, we have the courts to play. Ouais, je pense que toutes les étapes qui arrivent au sprint peuvent euh, me convenir, tout euh, la huitième que, que j'ai pointé. Voldooning, nervous. One big circus. <laughs>